See ya. What do you want? Nothing much. I heard you were back in town. Thought I'd pay you a little visit. I do something wrong? I don't know. You doing something you shouldn't be doing? It's just a figure of speech, man. Yeah? Well, it's just a figure of speech from me to you. But you better watch it, Mozart. Because next time, it's not going to be just juvenile hall. Sorry, but you ain't got nothing on me, man. I'm not writing anymore. Uh, cut the shit, you little asshole, okay? Look, I could haul your ass in right now just for violating your parole. But I'm not gonna do that. Because we're friends. Seeing friends help each other out, don't they? Yeah, but well, something does concern me. There's talk that the West Coast Kings are making a comeback. I don't know nothing about that, man. Huh. Your name was mentioned. Yeah, sure, nobody can prove anything about anybody, of course. But I'm warning you. We know more than you think we do. Man, I'm telling you, man. I've been out of the game for a while. Man. Yeah, that's what worries me. A little bit too long. Just better keep your hand out of the hey. cookie jar, Mozart. Okay? Do I make myself clear? Clear as day, officer.
Who is it? He's from the school. Tell him I'll be there in a minute. He doesn't have all night, you know. I'll be there in a minute, okay? So, I hear you graduate this year. Yep. So, what are your plans for the future? I haven't really thought about it. You ever consider pursuing a career in the arts? You mean paying for a living? Yeah. That would take all the fun out of it. <laughs> Why do you want to help a troublemaker like me anyways? What's in it for you? Richie, both you and I know you have a gift. Not something you learned at some school. Something you were born with. And yeah, in a way you're hiding from that. By hanging around with the wrong people. They're the troublemakers. The wrong people? You know what I mean. No, I'm afraid I don't. Look, I'm not labeling or judging your friends. I'm just saying they might be holding you back from reaching your full potential. Who told you all that shit, my P.O.? <laughs> I didn't come here to give you a sermon about what's right and what's wrong. I came here to offer you a future. Richie, you have a gift. You have something that other people only dream about. Do something with that. Don't be like your brother, end up wasting it on something that fades away and gets forgotten about tomorrow. And you know what? My, my brother is not forgotten. Right? Hundreds of people have seen Ivan's art. They know who he is. How many people know you? Huh? You know, you better check yourself before you come into my house speaking my brother's name like that. The deadline for this application is this week. If I don't hear from you by Friday, I'm going to assume you're not interested. Now, Richie, I have a scholarship with your name written all over it. If you're stupid enough to pass that up, you're going to make me regret not listening to what your parole officer told me. He said you were a waste of my time. I don't believe him. In addition to the application, I'm also going to need some samples of your work. That's the address to my studio. You have a studio? Just meet me there Wednesday at 4. Well, it's been a pleasure talking with you, Mr. Jimenez. Hope to see more of your work. Man, I'm telling you, Rich, it's not crazy out here. Cops are way more on the shit now about tagging. Taking all kinds of risks going out there and doing a piece, you know what I mean? It's not a fucking game with the cops anymore, man. Letters are getting killed. And the old values and respect, man, that shit is gone. These new kids out here, they ain't writers. Fucking gangsters. Fucking tag bangers, bro. Shit's changed big time, man. I mean, these fools are fucking killing each other over graph, you know what I mean? I'm so bad, fool. I don't even like going out of the bench anymore. Because the aces up there are fucking crazy, dude. If 
motherfucker is this dude at the bench, Annie? Hey? Nothing but gangsters are in this piece now, bro. You know what, man? Your boy Shifty? He's joining ranks with him, dude. <laughs> yeah. That fool thinks he's a fucking gangster. Ever since he got shot, man, ever since he got shot, he thinks he's indestructible or some shit. <sighs> Serious. That fool's been starting beef with everyone. You know what, though, Rich? I'd stay clear of him if I was you, bro. CABC's man, another bad creation. Art before crime. You remember Alex? Yeah. I remember him that skinny little white boy. He used to hang in the bottoms. I remember that fool. He used to run up and down the black claiming he was a writer. My brother used to hook him up with markers and shit. The kid got hard. Couldn't write worth of shit, man. That kid was a toy. He's not a fucking toy no more, dude. He calls himself AM. He's about the only one putting in work right now as far as grab's concerned. That fool fucking sleep. Hey, que pasa, güero? What's up, Chino? Check out my new throws, man. You like? No, but I... I, I thought S's were the ones running this piece. Yeah, no, man. Remember Rain's cousin Gonzo? Yeah, I remember guys. Wait, that's his cousin? Yeah, man, that's why the ABC's got protection all the way around and shit. But now that you're here, the way I look at it, we can reclaim our territory, bro. You know what I mean? I mean, these fools ain't fucking magic. Look at them. Nothing but scrubs with dry ass markers and shit that choke in the street. <laughs> look, Chino, man. Done. I'm retired. I'm retired. I don't run anymore. Oh, you ever saw Dawn is calling it quits, bro? Yeah, I'm out. Oh, shit. Are you serious, man? So, what you gonna do now then, fool? Just focus on my art. See where it takes me. Right on, man. Legend, right? Oh, that's a legend, right? Word, word, word. You know what? The legend ain't right no more, bro. Man, what's up, man? How come you ain't bombing no more? I just ain't. You know what? Give it a week or two, man. He'll come around. Right, Mo? Nah, nah. I, I, I'm serious, man. I, I ain't writing no more. Man. That's it. Whatever you say, for that. So, what they give you? I got a year in juvie. Got a year of probation. You name it, I got it, man. Well, I got cousins who get mad drive-bys. And they only got six months in Los Padrinos. Oh, fuck a year in juvie, you know what I mean? What's fucking tripping me out is the fact they let that fool that killed Ivan walk. I mean, when that white boy got caught riding in Singapore, the fucking president of the United States got on fucking national television and begged him to let that motherfucker go. The president didn't give a shit about Ivan, though. It's fucked up, fool. It's fucked up. Last year's release of Andrew McCarthy has many community leaders still up in arms tonight. The Los Angeles resident, 45 years old, made headlines after shooting a 17-year-old graffiti artist. According to McCarthy, he was attacked by the taggers after approaching them about vandalizing his property. Several black and Latino activists were outraged when Richie Jimenez, brother of the slain youth, was sentenced to a year in juvenile hall.
this coming shortly after McCarthy's release and being freed of all charges. Earlier today, hundreds of protesters were outside the L.A. District Attorney's Office demanding justice for the slain youth. Maria Flores, a representative from Mecha, is one of the many protesters here today. The treatment these children have received is unjust. No matter how serious the state wants to make this appear, this is just a case of kids having fun. These attempts to justify Mr. McCarthy's actions are preposterous. To state that incidents such as the murder of Mr. Jimenez are the response of ordinary citizens driven to violence by unruly youth is insane. By letting this man walk free, we are setting up a system that justifies vigilante attacks. Thank you, Maria. Richie. Richie, did you hear me? Mm -hmm. What? I said, what's wrong? Nothing. You know, I wish they would just leave you alone. Jen, you don't think about dying. What? I mean a natural death, not suicide or anything like that. No, why would you ask me something like that? Come on, Richie, okay? If there's something bothering you, then we can talk about it. I'm tired, Jen. Well, you should get some sleep. You've had a rough day. I'm not that kind of tired. I'm tired of living. I'm tired of seeing everything in black and white. I'm tired of people telling me what to do. I'm, I'm just tired. Okay, Richie, you're scaring me. All right, now, whatever this is, it's going to be all right. Okay, just wait and see. Yeah, let's leave. Get the fuck out of the way. Okay. All right. Just let me pack my stuff first. <laughs> I don't mean right this minute. Where exactly is it that you want to go? Hmm? Hmm? Uh, Some place far from here. <laughs> you know, it's funny. All those days in the halls, I just couldn't wait to get home. But now that I'm here, I can't wait to leave. Go check it out. We'll pack up.
what's up? The black and white? No, oh, man, it's some dude in the trench coat. Is there a problem? Yeah, there's a problem. Well, what is it? You. Whoa, whoa, man, hold on. Don't you think you're taking this a little too far? Tripping. You said you were gonna bump the one. You didn't say shit about a throw up. Man, just relax yourself and watch my back. What you doing, Holmes? I put the kid away, man. Fuck you, my mom was done. God damn it, Shelton, you promised no bullshit. Put the fucking kid away. 
guys bang? Where you from? Nah, we don't bang. Well, what's this shit then? You a tagger? Why are you fucking up my hood, that's it? We didn't know this was your hood, okay? We'll just back up and get our way. Shit ain't that simple, huh? You picked the wrong wall to fucking paint on. I'll tell you what, man. We'll paint the entire wall up. We'll finish it with little dude. What do you say? What do I say? I said I should clean the fucking walls with your face. What's up, bro? What you got there? A couple of ink heads. Part of disrespect in the barrio. What should I do with these nozzle necks? So you can change. You know this, Marco? Yeah, you Better not catch Esther riding in the barrio anymore. Next time you might not be so lucky. Dispenser. Dispenser at all. Hey, which is my people. They call us. Don't diss, Holmes. Venga. I always get cool with you and your hermano, right? And I never had any problemas about you painting your murals in my body, have I? Uh, what's up? I like the murals, they're cool. But lately, that pinche mayate shitty? He's been painting these bullshit tags all over my body. He has big cojones to be crossing out our hood, I say. No respecto por nada. You tell that mayate to chill out for his own good. And you tell him to stop writing your name. Because that could get you in a lot of trouble. You don't want any trouble, do you? Look, Gonzo, I ain't trying to beef with anybody, especially you guys. I have nothing but respect for you, you know that. Man. Shifty, he's just been acting real crazy lately, man. Something's just not right in his head. It's, you know, I'm sure it's just a mistake. Of man. course it's a mistake, but what if that shit happens again, huh? I gotta take care of business. You know the game, Essay. But since you're vouching for the Mayate, if it comes down to it, I'll do it. Right. Right, man. I, I understand. Look. I'll, I'll straighten things out, I'll just talk to him. It's on you, Vato. Next time there'll be a lot less talk. Comprendes? What the fuck is this? Well, you've been tagging again? What the hell are you talking about? What's this? Shifties. I can't believe you still hang out with that guy. He's such a jerk! Yeah, that jerk happens to be my best friend. <sighs> you know, just because he still writes doesn't mean I do, okay? Now I'm sick and tired of people accusing me of shit. I'm not accusing you. 
Well, I'm not tagging. Okay? Okay. Babe. Come on, what you talk about this? And you know I've been on my best behavior. You better not be tagging again, Richie. That's all I gotta say. Babe, I'm not... Fuck! Look, I'm sorry, okay? I just don't want you getting into trouble again. I won't, babe, I promise. But you're gonna have to trust me on this. Richie, please don't die on me. Why would you say something like that? Because I'm worried about you. you know, I'm going for a walk. Just be careful, okay? That load in here. Did you really scope that spot out? Man, you know how I operate. No, I don't. I don't know what goes on inside that crazy head of yours, man. That spray paint's been fucking up your memory. Did I teach you anything? It's all in the planning, man. You plan, then you execute. Man, I ain't got time for all that planning shit. I'm a bomb. A bomb shit. Oh, yeah? Well, Gonzo told me to tell you that you better stop riding in his hood. Again. Gonzo. Fuck Gonzo. Fuck him and his punk ass cousin. Tired of them fools. Especially tired of you listening to them motherfuckers. Well, you better stop bombing in the turf. Can't believe you, man. You and I gonna put murals all up in the neighborhood, and just gotta put one little cheesy throw up, you all on my ass like I did something big. You crossed them out! Man, fuck them fools. They slashed me out first. Besides, it's our hood anyway. All right. But keep talking shit, man. They're gonna end up killing your ass. Sounds like I'm talking to my daddy. Yeah, and I should beat your ass like he does, man. This the one right here, dog. Can I fuck with that? All right. If anything else pops off, you on your own, man. Don't worry, I can handle mine. Oh, I've seen you handle yours. I end up bailing you out of trouble every time, man. Someone's gonna end up blessing your ass, that's that. Ain't nobody gonna shoot me. Yeah, you're right. Because you're gonna move out of the way and the bullets are gonna hit me. Come on, Richie, man, come on. Look, I'm sorry about Gonzo on the other day, man. I was just trying to get my name up. Well, you gotta stop riding the turf. Right, right. And you gotta stop hitting up my name. No problem. And you gotta square things away with Gonzo. Fuck no. Gonzo's a fucking psychopath. No way, man. Well, do something, man. You don't want beef with that motherfucker. Trust me. I tell you what, man. Let's just go to my house. We'll drink some brews. I got a brand new PlayStation 2. We'll just chill out, man. I'm sorry, but I gotta meet this mom from Cat 4. Going Hollywood on me, man. Fooling it ain't even like that. We'll just chill some other time.
how is it you get all this beautiful artwork then you go down the street a couple of blocks and you see the same guys tagging signs and pay phones and fences and people's houses. It's because huh? you're mixing taggers and graffiti artists. <sighs> like there's a difference. Yeah, big difference. Old rap artists start out of staggers. But like all things, you evolve. Yeah, well, just because you can use a spray can doesn't make you an artist. Besides, what you're doing is illegal. <clears throat> Let me tell you something. Every day on my way home, I see at least 20-something liquor rats. I've lived in this neighborhood all my life, and I've never, not once, seen Joe Camel or the Marlboro Man kicking it on my block. But yet, these fools are posted all over my entire neighborhood. So what you're telling me is, if I had enough money, it'll be okay for me to fix property, right? While all these kids around here have no textbooks, most of them not even a chair to sit in. The government sits there Spends over forty million dollars a year on graffiti abatement. Then you got the cops doing nothing but arresting kids that are doing nothing but expressing themselves the only way they know how. And they're issuing criminal records that are handicapped them for life. My brother, Ivan. He lost his life because of self-expression. If you think graffiti requires no talent, then here. Paint. I wish you the best of luck. You'll get your application by Friday. Shit, you know the pigs. Always threatening you and shit. They just took me down to the station and asked me some questions. Shit. What is it? your shit up, man. Ride or not, you shouldn't let this shit ride. Bet you that punk motherfucker AM. Hey, Richie, man. Where you going? What you gonna do?
fucked it up. What? Are you fucking dead? Get the fuck up! No, what are you doing, man? Get up! Oh, what? You smashed my fucking mule! Yo, sorry, I, I wouldn't even trip on you like that. Man, he a motherfucking lie. He slashed your shit. Look, man, hold it. I'm sure this shit is just a misunderstanding. I ain't trying to hear that shit, all right? You and your punk ass homies crossed out my murals. Now you want to talk that hold it shit? Get your bitch ass up. Rich, you need to cool that shit down, homie. Gino, this is my beef, all right? Who crossed out my murals, huh? I don't know. You don't know? How don't you know? Who crossed them out? Look, man, I don't know who the fuck you think you are. Coming in here, acting all fucking bad, Mr. Mozart. In case you haven't realized, I'm all fucking city. My crew's running LA. You call yourself a writer? You don't fucking hit heavens. You ain't doing ledges. You're a fucking bookworm. Last I heard, you even let your own kinfolk die. Like a bitch that you are. So get the fuck out of here. Something right again? I'll tell you what, punk. You and your cronies have one week to show who got the most juice. Your crew or mine. Tino will be the judge. The rules are simple. Cans only, no health in your game bag and hood boys, and only landmarks still standing Sunday will count. Whoever loses will have to give up their early ride and privileges. One more thing. <laughs> All right, check it out. These youngsters have probably never battled anyone before. So chances are they're gonna end up wasting their pain tonight, hitting up from some bullshit spots. Now you're gonna feel a little intimidated tomorrow morning when you wake up and you see your neighborhood completely covered in paint. But don't sweat it though, because by midday, all of their hit ups will get painted over. So come Sunday, they will have wasted all their supplies and all their time, but might still have a few standing landmarks left. Not even enough to make them look like a legitimate crew, right? right. So what we're gonna do is wait. Wait? We can't just stand here while these monkeys cover our hood and their bullshit. We gotta act now while we still got the upper hand. Have you ever battled someone before, bro? Huh? Because I've taken out three crews, ten riders, and whole fucking city blocks. So until you can ignite that sort of bomb, you need to sit down and just shut the fuck up, all right? Yeah, all right. All right man. Who made you the leader, Doug? Ivan, that's man. who, man. See, I didn't get walked onto this crew, bro. I had to go through mad shit to get down with WCK, you know what I'm saying? I mean, I remember back in the day to be WC, you had to be fucking fantastic, you know? Yeah. That's what the West Coast King was all about, man. Just skills and bombing, bro. See, in my book, Rich and I were the last official members, you know what I mean? Everybody else is secondary, man. I was here in the beginning, man. You weren't. Yeah, but I took a bullet for this crew. Now, is that what Graf's all about now, bro? Toys like you trading in their spray cans for guns, man? Please, get the fuck out of here, man. Come on, come on. When was the last time you even held a spray can? I'm the only one here putting in work. All I hear is talk. At this rate, the ABCs are gonna stomp us like cockroaches. You know what? You need to tell them to just shut the fuck up, guys, Rich, all right? Guys, fuck, come on. Come on. How are we gonna win this thing if we don't even have each other's backs? Fucking Shifty, let it ride, man. And Chino. Come on, guys. Come on, y'all shake hands. Come on. This, this, this squash this shit right now, all right? We got a battle to win. Go, come on. You know what, Rich? Aim isn't any fucking different for me, man. I remember when you used to be just like him out there trying to put your name up, and that's all that fucking mattered, bro. But now you're just like this punk. You know what? As long as he's around, 
You can count me out, man. Hey, Chino. Man, Chino, come on, him, man. Richie. We don't need him. I got your back, man. Trapeze artist, OG scribe, exhibitionist, Montana cryline, belt liquid at your activist. Beats banging in the headphones, killing billboards to heavens. Mom and service arteries with ultra flat black, my brethren. From tags to burners, mom dude, she didn't nag. I caught two felonies, snitch head, this dip got me bagged. I laugh though, now I get paid for doing crap. Bro, your hash, bro, Tonka toy, change your name to John Doe, a black bro. To your weed paste, post the hoes. Leave it to the king, you got no can control. Take a hike. Off the shore, my yeah. high high. Huh. Yeah. Love Lonnie Cottrell and the folks, brothers. Undercovers jumping out of ghost buses. Lunchbox windows and grills with grease bumpers. $500 hero graffiti writer hunters. I slap tag a RTD camera lens. Shoot polish driver side and rush hour traffic in. Illegal artist, I ain't asking permission. I snatch transfers, then travel to rack my ammunition. A Rambo belt of uni paints from Michaels. Four color streaks cut from Hallmark props to April. A transit bandit, silent crimes and troubled times. I hear cans rattle and the echo of scribes. <laughs> The 10, 405, 605, 91, 101, hop the 5 to the 10, H1, 805, that's Mike Major Deegan, RTD, MTA, LBT, NYC, Fox, Squad, L Trains, Bus Grills, LAPD, STP, Ecstasy, DELOZ, CLK, FBD, PD, 2D, UASKANTSIFK, RTN, OTRTS, SSKE, TNT, FC, FX, AOK, KOS, KTC, LC, BLA, KBH, NASA, Crew who mob and I see Sakura shake a bull fat cap ultra wide Mean streaks in these mean streaks to be live I gotta go. What? Shift is in trouble. What the fuck did he do now? I'll explain to you later, okay? Richie, I gotta run. Please don't go, okay? Just, just don't. Okay, just let somebody else play his hero. I have a bad feeling about this. I gotta go, okay? I, I gotta go. Richie, what? Huh? Why well, don't? I owe him. That's why I owe him. He's a fucking loser. He's my friend. He's gonna get you killed. Oh, Jen, you're not listening to me, okay? He saved my life. If it hadn't been for him, I would have died out there. So what? Oh, you owe him your life now? Richie, if you walk out that door, don't you have a Sorry, Jim. Listen, I need backup. What are you talking about? 
Shifty. Wait, 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 wait a minute. Shifty? Yes. You come to my house, wake me up in my sleep. What the fucking prick? Have you lost your fucking mind, Rich? Look, man. I need your help. All right? If we don't go down to the park, they're gonna jump on him. Good. He deserves it. Look, Chino. I know you don't like him, but he's WC, man. He's fair. Let's get something straight, man. That fool was never WC. The only fucking reason I let him hang around us was out of respect for you. And when I told you not to hang around him because he was nothing but fucking trouble, did you listen to me? Huh? No, you were nothing, you did your own fucking thing. Look, Rich, man, I'm a writer, not a gangster, bro. My bomb was, I don't fucking bust drive bys. Look, man, I didn't come here for a lecture, all right? I just need a simple yes or no. else, give me a holler, man. I'm here for you. Not with this, man. Not for that fucking fool. So it's like that. On my own. Yo, get up, punk! Come on, get the fuck up! Oh, you don't want to get Get up, punk! Hey, dog. Check it out. What are you guys, fucking each other or what? Oh, I thought we settled this with the battle. Yo, man, the battle don't end till midnight. There's no way you could possibly make a comeback? Is that what this is about? No, this has nothing to do between you or your crew, man. This has to do with me and this little faggot right here. You fuck with him, you fucking with me. Mozart, if you don't get the hell out of here, I'm gonna fuck you up. Real good. Just like I did your little girlfriend. Hey man, fuck this fool up. Come on, fuck him up. Fuck him up, fam. Got him, dog. Come on. Fuck all this graffiti shit, Mozart. You wanna get down? Got the fucking mark right here. We get down. Thank you, dog. You never a real writer anyway, man. Your brother made you. You just took all the credit. Like the little poser that you are.
Why are you doing shifty, huh? <laughs> Why? You still don't get it, dude. You have everything. You're a great artist. All the little homies look up to you. But me, what do I have? I have nothing. If you were in my shoes, you would have done the same thing. You so dead, man. <laughs> you so fucking dead. <laughs> You can't kill me, I'm already fucking dead. <laughs> Besides, you should be thanking me. This is the second time I've saved your fucking life. You owe me. I'll see you around, Shifty. I'm sure you have a fucking bright future ahead of you, man. Oh, by the way, you be even now. <laughs> I was only trying to be like you, Mozart one, the baddest graffiti writer in all of LA. What, you think just cause you went to juvenile hall that changes something? No, you're just like me. I seen it in your eyes. The night you challenged AM to the battle, you lit up like a fucking Christmas tree. It's the first time since you've been back from juvenile hall I've seen you fucking happy. It's the first time I've seen you fucking alive. door. Jen, listen. 
you were right about everything. Shifty's no good. I'm done with him, okay? He's out of my life. Forever. I know I fucked up. I know that. Look. I'll leave. I promise. I want to apologize. Before I go, I just... I don't want things to end like this. Jen, I want you to have this. It means a lot to me. Take care of it, please. Bad. We could have had a smoke. Don't I know you from somewhere? I've seen you somewhere before. You must have me mixed up with someone else. Yeah, you're probably right. Oh, hey! That's him, man! That's the motherfucker that shot Gonzo's cousin! <laughs> Get that fool, Holmes. I'll get that fool later. We'll get that fool.
Come on, man. You don't really want to do that. I told you next time you wouldn't be so lucky. 